Peyton Manning began the season sluggishly, but he guided his Colts to a blaze of victories that propelled his team into the playoffs. And when it came time to select the NFL's best player, leadership and clutch wins seemed to be the determining factors, with Manning being named the MVP for the third time in his career. It was Drew Brees, not Manning, whose 5,000 passing yards led the league. It was the Saints quarterback and Phillip Rivers of the Chargers, whose 34 touchdowns tied for the NFL lead. And it was Chad Pennington of the Dolphins and Kurt Warner of the Cardinals, who had higher passing completion percentages. However, it was Indy's unflappable play caller who led his team to nine straight wins to end the season and the Colts' seventh straight playoff appearance. And boy, did the voters notice. Manning uh, was a runaway winner, which is a bit surprising because there were a lot of good candidates this year. I think a lot of people would have supported someone like Chad Pennington on the Dolphins. It could have been a good year for a defensive player, perhaps, to win it. And James Harrison of the Steelers is one who got quite a bit of support. In this, the 52nd year of the award, Manning picked up 32 of the 50 votes cast. Coming in a distant second were Falcons running back Michael Turner and Pennington, who each garnered just four votes. Peyton Manning now joins Brett Favre as the only three-time winners of the MVP award. Favre won it actually two and a half times if you uh, want to look at it that way because he tied one year with Barry Sanders. Oddly, same thing goes for Peyton Manning. In 2003, Manning shared the award with Steve McNair before winning it outright in 2004. The 11-year veteran overcame minor but nagging off-season knee surgery to throw for just over 4,000 yards and 27 touchdowns. Manning also led the 3-4 and four Colts to wins week after week when the playoffs seemed like a long shot. But Indy now has yet another postseason berth and its sixth straight 12-win season, an NFL record. And Manning has his place in history. Dave Lubeski, The Associated Press.